Mag back on. Quick exposure. Now, I don't understand this video clip right here. It's an old video clip from Disney, basically. Disney showing you this right here on the Today Show. We go get into it and see if we can put this in context right here and understand it. See if we can grasp it as you can see. The Mickey Mouse on screen right there with Miley Cyrus. And we go get into it and see what they're talking about with them so-called creating these characters like a Miley Cyrus. Take a look at this right here, people. Let's get into it. Make it run. Today news. If you have kids at home, this next segment is for you. This Friday, the newest batch of Disney Channel stars grown in the Disney Genetic Engineering Lab will be unveiled to the public. You right. hear that, people? They're talking about digital and engineer, genetic engineer, basically characters. So pay attention right here, people. They're acting like they're telling you something, but they're telling you something else, if you understand. Take a listen right here. Pay attention. Tracy, most of our viewers are already familiar with a lot of the products that have come out of the Disney I know lab. I am. You hear that? <laughs> they, 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 they're familiar with the products that come from the Disney lab. Remember, I already told you, people, I break it down and tell you, basically, that all of those so-called stars is fake basically come from disney britney spears and them including this one miley cyrus and the masses sleep and hear them tell you right here in plain sight they actually create them in labs listen how exactly do you create a hillary duff or a mm -hmm. miley cyrus from scratch right. well you hear what they say people create them from scratch take a look at this right here the ones they used to hypnotize your kids on disney Wow. We're going to find out exactly how it's done right now because joining us live from the Disney Lab mm -hmm. is uh, one from of their the lead geneticists. Disney Lab, people. From the Disney Lab. Pay attention. Dr. Andrew Rourke. Welcome, Dr. Rourke. There's quite wow. an operation you've got going on out mm -hmm. there. Thanks, Jim. So the stars that this. we see on TV are mm -hmm. actually grown right here? Uh, that's correct. You hear what they just say, people? The stars that you see on TV is actually grown right here. Wow, people. What I tell you about the credits rolling. Pay attention here. They're, they're grown and uh, developed here. We engineer their brains for advanced singing and dancing capabilities. They, 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 let's go back. What did they just say, people? Wow. Unbelievable. Go back. Let's see what he say right here. Stars that we see on TV are actually grown right here. Uh, that's correct. They're, they're grown and uh, developed here. We engineer their brains for advanced singing and their dancing. Brain for advanced singing? Wow. We engineer their brains for advanced singing and dancing capabilities, even posing for photos. By the time they grow to desired size, mm -hmm. uh, these child stars are fully ready for the camera or the, the concert uh, tours or whatever. You hear that, people? They're fully ready for the shows and concerts. Can you believe that, people? Wow. <laughs> wow. All stars are fully ready for the camera or the, the concert uh, tours or whatever Disney chooses to put them in. That is simply <laughs> amazing. Now, how long does it take to actually create a star from scratch? Well, not very long at all. We use the exact same DNA structure for all of our stars. And then we simply tweak minor details like uh, hair color or skin tone. Right. Yeah, we do have wow. some footage here of some of the uh, well-known creations wow. that have come out Take of your lab. Take a look, people. Well-known creation that come from the lab. And you see that right there with all orange background. These are the characters they use on Disney. And don't worry about it. All those Hollywood characters, like I don't tell you, I tell you, all of the singers and all the people that they put up as stars and everything, they tie back to Hollywood from day one. All of them. All of them got a tie to Hollywood. Where did they come from? I always ask the questions. Where is these parents for these kids? Even kids in movie cussing and everything. Where is their parents? They create these people in lab. That's what you need to understand. They basically twist up DNA and genes to get these characters right here. Exactly what they just tell you. Take a listen. Yeah, well-known creations that have come out of your lab. Let's take a look. Yes, well, that's model 6831-A, wow. publicly known as Mitchell Musso, yeah. standard uh -huh. male base with oh, a type wow. 3 skin pigmentation. Wow. And that's model 6831-B. We give him slightly thicker eyebrows and type wow. 5 skin. Well, so it's sort of like putting a puzzle together. There. Exactly. They're laughing, people. It's sort of like putting a puzzle together right there as they expose this right here and the masses didn't see it.
they expose themselves, they show their hands right here in this little clip. They show you that those stars was created. They tell you they developed them brains and everything for them to sing. What you think, people? All those stars they give you in Hollywood is 100% fake. No doubt about it. Exactly. Amazing. Okay, here we've got Amazing. some of the images mm -hmm. of some of the newest Look. models. We're going to be seeing a lot of these kids mm -hmm. in the future. It really looks like you have someone for every... And Disney, Walt Disney is 33 in numerology. And they're the one who own your kids. Period, point blank. They own your kids with all those programming that they give you with the number three right there for the Mickey Mouse ears. Yes, all the program is to get your kids. And what's the, once they get them, New World Order begins. In America, mm -hmm. love well, that's here. the idea, Tracy. Our writers find it very liberating. Uh, for mm -hmm. example, our new model, Haley, is mm -hmm. a singing, dancing, snowboarding, half Japanese, half Indian girl. Mm -hmm. wow. Not finding her in reality would be impossible. That's right, but sounds like a wow. sure fight. finding her in reality would be impossible. But you can see them on Disney. They create them. 100%. All of them. All those singers, all those so-called movie stars and actors that they bring to the masses was created by Disney. The ones that control TV. They're the one who make them in lab. Hit to me. Right oh, here. now this one's Zac Efron. I've seen him before. Uh -huh. Yes, uh, Zac was actually one of our earliest models. My daughters Listen. love him. I mean, he go. looks so real. Actually, I think we could have done he better. He looks so real. There you go, people. All of these TV characters is made up. They fake. 100% and there you go they're exposing themselves uh, with Zach he could show more human tendencies uh, if, if you look closely you'll you notice see. there's a certain deadness around the eyes I do see wow. that yeah. I'm sorry sorry of for me to watch because see. all I see is uh, mm -hmm. all my mistakes yeah. Boy, he mm -hmm. seems flawless to me well he's wow. holding up but there was a bug in that first batch and as a result Zach's skin will soon begin to dissolve no wow. poor Zach Efron oh, wow. right. well, is they plain people no they're not they're actually telling you truth in plain sight right here, where is your favorite artist and movie star come from? How they get to be famous? How they get to be so-called talented in this devil earth? There you go. It been revealed. They was made in labs. 100% in. Catch me on the run. Bam.